Hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on, one minute. Hold on. What's that? 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 What's Yes, this is how I'll be coming. By the Supreme Court uh, judgment, I've been given license to dress in our religious attire because it should be infringed, it should be an infringement or a violation, a fraudulent violation of my fundamental rights to freedom of thought, conscience, and religion for anybody to stop me. So I went into the Supreme Court, and uh, you see, I've been given the license. Even my children will dress like this to the school. And uh, I will encourage my fellow traditionalists, those who are serving the local, and uh, Shongo and uh, Shokono, God of Thunder, God of Iron, I will encourage them to dress like this because it's always good to be religious. We need to be close to the spirits. You can see I'm not wearing any shoes. This is the, in fact, if I have told me that if I wear shoes, I'll be dead, what will I do? I have to obey the spirits. You see this eye? If without it, I, I can't see the evil spirits coming to attack me. So at least I can see them. Okay. So you see? Yeah. So we've been given license yeah. to, by the Supreme Court just, uh, judgment of Friday. We've been given the license to dress in our religious outfits because it's the mood, it's the mood of our, our worship. But in, in a situation that the security agent challenge you and you order for your arrest, how nobody, will you do? Nobody can do it. Nobody. Even the president can. Buhari can't arrest me. But in my, my own fundamental rights, nobody can. It's my fundamental rights. So, but since this one is alien to, to law profession, are you saying that you can stand before judge? I will. Do a matter? Sure, this is my outfit. Sure, this is my outfit. <laughs> I can stand anywhere. This my ask, what is alien? There is no law that there is no law, section 45 of the constitution that derogates the right to freedom of. Uh